What's up? What's up? What's up? You already know. This is Peach and Tall Day. I'm gonna be showing y'all some of what we bought the kids for Christmas. Now, we not done Christmas shopping yet. Daddy say yes, we is, but we not. We not, because I still got to get McIntyre a Nerf gun. And he still want that dinosaur thing. And then I want a Nerf gun. And I'm going to get Gregory a Nerf gun, because he wanted a Nerf gun. Why we ain't bought them guns yesterday that they wanted? Did they put them back or something? Why we didn't get those? And then, um, also, I got to get my oldest son a bike that he likes. I bought a bike. I'm going to show y'all the bike I bought. And also, um... He want a PS5. I asked at the last minute. Mom, can I get a PS5? Boy, do you know how hard it is to find a PS5 in these streets? But I got faith. I'm sure I'm going to find one. Let's get into it. All right, Peach Patch. Oh, yeah, let me do that. I'm going to open up the blinds and whatnot. Let's see if there's some flies up in these joints. These are kind of blinds. You just go like this. Bloop. That's it. Do this one. Hopefully, that give us better lighting. Alrighty. Yeah, that look way better. Daddy don't want to be on the video. He, I was like, babe, let's do it together. He like, nope. So he's in the garage with the little kids. Anywho, daddy gonna wrap all this stuff today. This is what we bought our four of five kids. It's mostly for Gorgeous and McIntyre and Choice and Baby. Daddy said we need to get Baby something else, but I don't know what else we should get Baby. So y'all tell me. What we did get is, I'm gonna start from the top. We got three of these Christopher dolls. This is what Choice called Christopher. So we got three of them. The reason being is because they was on sale for seven ninety nine. Yeah, seven ninety nine. You know your girl is a chick, 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 chick. Yay. So yeah, peach patch. That's why I got three. One, two, three. Plus Choice play with dolls. Gorgeous play with dolls. And baby play with dolls. So they gonna all have the same Christopher doll. And they gonna have to fight. The next thing I got is this pink selfie stick. I got this for gorgeous in me. Like, it's really for me, but it's going to be her Christmas gift. And if she don't love it, I'm going to take it. I also got this action camera selfie stick for McIntyre because he's working on doing YouTube as well. I bought these from Five and Below. The Christopher dolls I bought from City Trends as well as this Tommy doll. Y'all don't un understand how excited I was to find Tommy. Um, This baby alive, this is a boy baby alive. Tommy is like lily's co-star so i'm excited about it he already seen it this is the doll he was trying to get um mac uh baby to open now this doll right here i bought it because choice when we went to target he was looking at it and he liked it daddy hates this doll already he like we need to throw that doll out like take her back because she just do the most look he's my she's so annoying take her back so we got that as well i also bought gorgeous this jojo siwa watch i bought this from what store were we in? Burlington. It was $12.99 for this JoJo Siwa watch. I know she's going to love it. So that's for Gorgiana. Next, we got my other Christopher doll. And I got three. And then we got this baby alive as well. This one is for Gorgeous because she had hair. I was like, you know what? And she was on sale, y'all. She was on sale at Target for $17.99. So I'm going to go ahead and get that for Gorgeous. So Gorgeous can play with her hair. And she came with a blender. Sis, listen, this is my show. At right, uh, I'm going to take you back to Target like Daddy said. Now, shh, be quiet. She been doing the most since we bought her. Really? I, okay, we just going to excuse her. Matter of fact, let me move I her. I her in the storage closet. I'm seeing why Daddy's saying we need to take her back. Sister girl doing the most, baby. It's Peach McIntyre, not baby alive. Anyway, <laughs> Daddy's talking about your gifts look like doll fest. And it kind of is. I got a lot of kids that like dolls. Next, we have this. Doc McStuffins, Doc McStuffins. Yes, it says, it sings, wash your hands. Don't copyright claim me. I'm going to try you, okay? Don't try me. What? Hold on. Hi, I'm Doc McStuffins. Okay. Let me press it again. Here we go. Here's the song. Hey. Hey. So she sang, wash your hands song. It came with a Doc face mask. A little doctor bag, a little print thing of Lammy. That's not a real Lammy. And then a thethoscope and a little thing you hit your knees with. It came with that. But I like Doc McStuffins. That's one of my favorite shows. 
Like, I love, love, love Doc McStuffins. So, I had to get it. They had this in Walmart last night for $19.99. So, I went ahead and grabbed that joint for gorgeous. Next, we have this baby alive, which I'm going to say is Lily. It's called the Teeny Coins. Look like a little unicorn. This one is also for choice. So, this is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. This one is choice. That's baby's um, choice. And then this one is choice because Gorgeous got rid of his Lily. We cannot find his same Lily. She broke Lily's arm and daddy threw it away. So I'm trying to find the same Lily he had before. But this one was but this one was the closest one to it. You see she has kind of braids. So I just got it. He kind of over Lily right now. He's more into books, which is why we bought him the um, alligator to zebra ABC. He picked this book out yesterday when we were in Burlington. It was $4.99. So I went and bought it. It's one of his gifts, but he's already utilizing it. Another thing we bought is the fun to bake oven. Daddy actually bought this gift for Gorgeous because Gorgeous loves to cook. She always in our stuff, always messing with something. So Daddy was like, we going to get her easy bake oven. He's been saying that for forever. We finally got one. So thank you, Daddy. Shout out to Daddy. After that, we got this. I bought this. I love toys. I love puzzle pieces and things like that. I bought this for baby. I know it's the age is three and plus, but I'm going to use this with baby and gorgeous while they're home with me to work on their letters and their numbers and all that. And it came with a case. And I think this was $7.99. Yep. $7.99. So I just had to get this. So I bought this for baby. We're going to say this baby gift. That's why Daddy said we need to get baby more gifts because we really didn't get him nothing. But y'all have to keep in mind, baby is just one, and my mom takes care of Christmas. Like, I literally didn't have to buy my kids anything for Christmas. My mom got the power wheel. She got choice more animals. She got everything, bikes at her house for my kids. But this year, I am financially able to do a little bit more for my kids that I want to do. So, I decided that we might as well go ahead, and that's what we're doing. Next, we have this Shimmer and Sparkle Gem X Magical Set from gel to gems. Daddy bought this for Gorgeous as well. He was like, she gonna love this. Cause she's creative. Gorgeous loves doing stuff with her hands. She like doing makeup. She like trying to cook. She like playing with Play-Doh. She just loved doing stuff with her hands. So he felt like she was gonna love this. So daddy got her this. And then next, ooh, 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 I'm very proud of this purchase. This Hot Wheels purchase. They had this in a wrong spot at Walmart. This thing is normally $29, they had it in the spot for seven. So I got this for just $7. I tried to buy three, but the man was like, I could only give you one. And I was like, daddy, go back and get another one. But he never went back. So well, the next time I went, they had done changed it. So I couldn't go and get another one. So we got just one of these. This is gonna be for McIntyre. He's the one that's more into cars. Then over here, we have three of the Thunder Tumblers. I love this car. Actually, daddy loves it too. And it's cheap. For any of you who trying to get y'all kids a remote control car, I would highly recommend this one. It do flips. It turn different colors. My kids get a, one of these every year. And they last for about six months. And then they like lose it, leave it, don't want to play with it, lose interest. But we got them again because I think these were $9.99. Daddy picked these up. Daddy bought these. $9.99. Daddy was like, let's just get them for the boys. So one is for... um choice one for mac and one for baby that's why we bought three this right here i actually love this daddy bought this as well this unicorn um scooter but we were in walmart getting this stuff for gorgeous and i seen an older lady buying gifts for her grandkids and she had this unicorn which right now all little girls or at least like 90 percent of them are obsessed with unicorn shout out to jojo siwa because of jojo See why everybody's just going unicorn crazy. And Tiffany had it, you know, the um, black unicorn, whatever she calls stuff. Huh. Both of them got everybody loving unicorns, old and young. So that's another reason I got it. We did Gorgeous Room and Unicorns, which I'm going to show y'all. A Demons, I don't know how to say it. A unicorn scooter. I don't know the brand name, whatever. However you pronounce it. No, I can't announce it. Anyways, um, the thing would go inside of here, the stick. And that's it. It's like an easy assembly. Daddy gonna hook that up for her. We're actually about to start wrapping these gifts on up because these children already know what they got. We ain't got no tree. I might not buy a tree. I might get a tree from the Dollar Tree. <laughs> Anywho, the next thing we got, Daddy bought this too for Gorgeous. She, like I said, Gorgeous is busy. Gorgeous loves to do stuff. So Daddy had got her this ironing board. He was like, oh, this is perfect for her look. You know, so she could play around with this and act like she ironing clothes. It comes with 
includes electric iron, ironing board, water bottle, drying rack, four clothes pins, two hankies, and two clothes hangers. So she gonna have a little bit of stuff to play with. So that's for gorgeous. Next, I also got gorgeous these unicorn headphones. Now I bought these from five and below for five dollars. Just five dollars. I don't know if they're gonna be loud, but since her brothers got headphones, oh, I don't even got those out. Let me go. So them. boom, I went and grabbed the other headphones. So. Gorgeous is going to have these unicorn ones. I bought her these because her brothers, because her brothers all have the Zamco kids wireless over the headphone, over the ear headphones. This is for my older three boys. Got three, one, two, three for Christmas. So if y'all want these, I'm going to pin the link. I got them from Amazon. I'm going to pin the link in the comments down below so you can order you some. So I got that for them and then i got her these at five below because like i said unicorns are in style and i seen them i was like oh her favorite color pink and it's unicorns and it's only five dollars let me grab them joints and they got all kinds of characters too if y'all want to go up in five and below I'm go up in five below mm -hmm. i'm taking y'all in five below this man Eve. i just I like him a lot he got to play with his kids all right so down below oh this is my favorite gift of them all look at this baby doll barbie this was the last one also in the wrong spot i got sister girl for nine dollars barbie extra and she is really doing the most look at her hair gorgeous was like i loved it i love the hair she's seen everything she got which kind of sucks so i told daddy when we was little my mama really hid presents from us and we didn't know what we was getting but daddy like these children don't believe in santa claus um next we got these mics this is babies y'all know baby is my little michael jackson j5 um my kids are very into music just like their mom so daddy bought this one for baby and then he got this one for gorgeous it's barbie one and we got these from burlington and they were 11.99 a piece comment down below if you think that was a good deal we also got this from walmart this waddle pogo hopper mcintyre actually picked this out for gorgeous he was like get gorgeous this which they had a blue one too so i might go back and these were 15 dollars. i might go back and get mcintyre one too that way he don't have to use her stuff and i was like you want one he was like no just get gorgeous one for gorgeous um for christmas mcintyre just wanted a new bike and what else he said he wanted that was his main thing, a new bike, and my mom bought it. So he ain't really been wanting nothing. I also bought these balls right here. I don't care who get this. It's just like a little filler. I seen these in Five Below for $5 yesterday. I was just like, I'm going to grab them. They were behind the register. And then right here, this bike, this rocket bike, it was in the wrong place at Walmart as well. So I got a good deal. Shout out to the Walmart employees. Y'all, please keep putting that stuff in the wrong place for us parents on the budget. But yeah, they had this in the wrong spot um i never uploaded the video of me buying this stuff i do have videos of me buying some of this so i'll try to edit those and get those up but we got this huffy little rocky i don't know which child gonna use this maybe the baby maybe gorgeous but i got a good deal on it i sure did after that we got i already showed y'all this i just moved it down this waddle bouncer this was 14 dollars from walmart i got it for gorgeous because it was unicorns i seen another mom with it near me and i was like gorgeous i like that it's supposed to bounce it says across the world, unicorns symbolize purity, elegance, magic, and grace. Child, anyways, they seen JoJo Siwa popping with the unicorn, so they just decided we're going to make all unicorn toys. I ain't never seen so many unicorns in my life. I know it came from JoJo, but I got it because that's the new vibe. And then I already showed y'all the Barbie. We got this Razor scooter for $98 from Walmart for McIntyre. I bought him this because my nephew got one. And him and my nephew like best friends. And I'm like, when they together, they could both ride together. So that's why McIntyre got that. That was $98. And it goes for 40 minutes up to 8 miles per hour. A 12-volt battery. After that, we have the scooters. This scooter I bought for Baby, and then this scooter, which I don't know if Baby gonna be able to ride this yet, but it looked colorful, and it looked kid-friendly, so that's for Baby. And then these other two scooters I bought for McIntyre of Choice. I don't know if Choice will ride a scooter, but I don't like to leave him out, so that's Choice Scooter. And then down here, I bought this from Target, this deluxe nursery set, which I don't remember how much it was. I wanna get Baby one. Because lately, him and Gorgeous have been fighting over her baby dolls. And she already got a new baby doll stroller that her dad bought. And him and her was fighting over it. I'm like, babe, I was about to open this and just let baby have it. But daddy said no. So we ended up opening baby's bike. Baby got this bike, this little um, 
Is this a tight? No, this is a radio flyer. This radio flyer bike. I've always wanted one of these gorgeous. She used to have a pink one, but it wasn't like this. It didn't fold and stuff. My mom had got it for her. This one actually folds up. It got the little cover. You know, you can adjust this and steer it with it. And then it has a basket in the back, but this one is foldable. So it's not one of those hard baskets like the one Gorgeous had, the pink one she has. And it transforms into just a tricycle when they want to learn to ride it like normal. Another thing I bought is this bike right here, which we're debating about taking it back or not. This bike, I got it for my oldest son. He wants one of those bike life bikes, some things like anywhere between $600 and $1,200. That's what he wants. And he wants a red bike. So we were looking for a red bike, an affordable one, but we couldn't find it. And then the BMX bikes, the cheapest one I found is $7.99. And whoo, baby, I got five kids. So I bought him this for $98. But then I started thinking back when to I was a kid and all I wanted for Christmas was a diary with my name on it. And instead of buying me a diary with my name, my mama bought me jewelry that said peaches, earrings that said Miss Peaches, a big old chain that said Miss Peaches. And I was boohoo crying. And then I thought about my son. My son is not a bad kid. He makes great grades. He's in all advanced classes. We are in a position to be able to afford him a bike. I actually, I'm so blessed. God is so good. I actually got a phone call this morning. Shout so out. To, I want to give a big shout out to All Love Bike Riding in Tampa, Florida. Mr. Ronald Henry and Mr. Sean. They actually called me this morning after seeing me post this bike. I was like, well, my son like this. Like, it was $98. Like, I got five kids. I can't be around here spending no $1,000 on no bike. No $750 on no bike. And they actually called me on the phone. They educated me more on BMX bikes and they actually said, hey, Peaches, we're going to actually help you get him that bike. And so they are contributing with buying my son's bike. So we're going to go get that today as well, which I was like, you know, I mean, I can buy the bike. It's like, but I can't buy the bike, you know, like I'm cheap and I really can't afford to spend this kind of money on no Christmas gift. I don't want to like I don't see the value in no thousand dollar bike. But they was letting me know like Peaches, when he gets ready to sell this bike. He'll most likely get almost all his money back or at least like two. He'll be out of two or three hundred dollars. You know, um, you can resell them. They're great bikes. And when he want to go bike riding with his cousins, because my cousin, my nephew, my niece, all of them, they have these type of bikes. And he's the only one without this bike. And he never want to bike ride with them. And it was like, that's probably why he don't want to bike ride with them, because his bike don't fit in. Like, if you want to be a great mom and just shine and make your child happy this Christmas, get him the bike. So... We're going to get on a bike. Follow them. If you in Tampa, they do a monthly bike ride. They bike ride once a month. You can bring any kind of bike. You can ride this. They told me peaches come Sunday, so I'm going to go Sunday. Um, ride my beach cruiser bike. I was like, but I'm kind of slow. You know, I'm a big girl mama. I don't bike ride that fast. You know, I cruise on my cruiser. And it was like, it's fine. We have emergency vehicles that follow us and make sure everybody's safe. We pass out water. It's just... Um, to give everybody some exercise, let them see the city, and to stop gun violence. When the kids are out riding their bikes, having fun, being kids, they don't got time to be shooting and killing each other and all that craziness. I'm getting chills just talking about it. I cannot wait to go. So it's this Sunday, December. What is this Sunday? Hold on. It's this Sunday, December 20th, 2020. Now, in regards to this bike, me and Daddy are debating on taking it back, keeping it, or donating it to a another family so we playing around with all of those ideas because we have bikes everybody has a bike except my oldest he does he's the only one that doesn't have a new bike yet but yeah and then the net last thing that we got is wrapping paper show y'all wrapping paper i got every kid different wrapping paper i haven't wrapped christmas gifts in years i just want to cry like i feel like i'm not in a position yet to like bless another family full fully like take care of their whole christmas but yesterday I was able, when I was in Target, I was able to bless a little girl with a, a unicorn. I was going to get it for Gorgeous. It was like a talking, light up unicorn Barbie purse thing, which I was going to buy for Gorgeous. But I seen this white lady. You can read the story on my Instagram. It's a long little story, but it was a beautiful experience. She, her and her husband, they were doing like those secret Santa things where you adopt the kid, adopt the kid. And they adopted an entire family. I bought one gift off of the list that I didn't even know was on the list. And she was about to cry. And we exchanged names. It was just beautiful. But anywho, I got 
this baby shark do 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 baby shark 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 do 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 yeah i got this for baby got him baby shark or mcintyre and choice i got them published they're gonna have the same wrapping paper i mean it ain't that much difference i was looking for an animal wrapping paper for choice like a lion or a tiger but i couldn't find one so for now, unless I find something different, it might be Paw Patrol. And then lastly, for Gorgeous, I got JoJo Siwa with the unicorns. Come through, JoJo. And Bobo. Let's see the unicorn. Boop. See, Bobo. I love JoJo Siwa. I just love her hustle. Like, that little girl inspired me so much. Y'all don't understand. If you don't watch JoJo Siwa, go watch her. I think she's probably the hardest working YouTuber. She worked hard. Um, What else I was going to say? Trying to think. So we're debating about this bike. We don't know what we're going to do. Because I, I like this bike. I want to keep it. But I was thinking about it. I'm like, somebody's going to bless us. Somebody's going to bless us by helping buy a bike for my son, a BMX bike. I might as well bless a kid with this bike. A kid that will appreciate it more than my child. So that's most likely what I'm going to do. I'm going to tell daddy. Babe, let's go ahead and get this bike away. In regards to like power wheels and stuff like that, my mom is buying that. I'm going to show y'all outside. We have been so blessed. Every year my mom buys power wheel so this is old like choice been got this like three years ago gorgeous got this last year but she got a new one coming this is my bike my this mcintyre bike he has a new bike coming for christmas that my mom bought him it's a green bike it's at her house these are two bikes like tricycle bikes they got these um about how old is mac mac is six no mac is mac is six Damn, I don't know how old my own kid is. Hold on, y'all. Mac is five. Okay, sorry. McIntyre is five. So they got these like three years ago, and we still got them. And they're in pretty good condition. Like, we take care of the stuff that we get. I don't like giving stuff it's away. It's bad. I, I really don't like giving stuff away. I love Daddy Sam a hoarder. I love keeping clothes. I love keeping shoes. I love keeping toys and just passing them down. That's the kind of person I am, like passing them down to my kids. I watched a lot of little... Hallmark movies and stuff when I was young and just to see when people put their stuff in the attic and when the kids grow up and have kids and they give the grandkids the same bike their daddy had your daddy first bike I've always wanted to be that kind of parent like I've always wanted to have my own house and have all my kids toys in the attic even though I don't think we got attics in Florida but yeah probably in the garage but keep all the kids toys and all that gorgeous old dolls and all that and then give them to their children like your mom had that and then when their kids get big and have kids they give it to their kids and it just becomes a family heirloom i've always wanted to do stuff like that so i think that's why i don't like to give anything away i like to keep it my sister like peaches i give stuff away because i know i'm gonna get better but i'm like but you could just keep it and save it for your grandkids she's like i ain't gonna have no grandkids who thinks about grandkids when your kids little Tires. other bike like i said i don't like to give stuff away this bike i actually bought for ten dollars from the bike man mcintyre wanted a bike we didn't have it like that got him this bike for ten dollars from the bike man that's why i should have went while i'm acting all brand new and then my mama bought him that for christmas last year so that's how he got two this is choice bicycle from last christmas which mcintyre just started riding this one because it's bigger oops but it's in pretty good condition too mcintyre literally just started riding this like this last week and then over here is my son's scooter that played music and all that. He got this last Christmas as well. So everybody got a bike. Oh, let me show y'all daddy bike. bike. Which I'm debating about getting her a new bike. Um, I wouldn't suggest you buy a bike with white tires. Gorgeous tires are white. Mine are like a cream color. And they so dirty looking. I wasn't thinking about that when I bought them. I was just like, oh, it's frozen and all that stuff. She had broke her little tassels all off. But then daddy had got her some more. So she got more tassels and she got this bill. Her daddy bought her this. Hey, pretty girl. Um, but with this, I was like, babe, we should get her another bike. Because at Target, they have the LOL doll bikes. And Gorgeous is over there playing in the dirt. So that's why she's dirty and barefoot. That's her new thing. They got an LOL bike at Target for $63. But Daddy was like, we don't need that. She don't need no another bike. And then right here, Peach Patch, I got um, Gorgeous. I mean, Daddy bike. <laughs> over here i got daddy bike this is daddy's bike i bought him as a christmas gift i gotta get daddy another christmas gift as well but this was one of his christmas gifts he does actively ride it and then look at my baby doll busting it wide open child choice gonna hurt her hey baby <laughs> baby over here playing in water soaking wet soaking wet 
face so messy. That's why you got snot now. That's why you cough for now. This tub right here, we bought this for choice as a Christmas gift. But honestly, it has become baby's favorite. It actually sprays out the water. Daddy said we got to dump this because it's dirty. Dirty. He going to pour you some more. Oh, you going to do it yourself. Oh. Okay, then. Oh, don't wait me. No. <laughs> Now this, that's my daddy was sitting right there watching baby out and peach patch i just wanted to come talk to y'all about you know christmas i know around the holidays people can get super depressed if they can't provide all of the stuff that we provided or even a fraction of the stuff that we provided for our kids i just want to let you guys know that there have been times in my life where i couldn't afford to give my kids this the most important gift you can give your kids is love support and encouragement i'm happy we're able to buy this I didn't have to. My mama handles Christmas every single year since my first child. Shout out to my mom and me father. They're very materialistic. Like, they into materials. That is their love language. So, they love gifting their grandkids all nine. No, it's, yeah, nine. All nine of them. They do it every year. So, on Christmas, y'all will see us at my mama's house getting the big stuff like bikes, power wheels, baby got a Mercedes Benz, stuff like that. My mom does that every year since Gregory was born. But... I just remember times when I wanted to do stuff for my kids, do a little bit more, and I couldn't do it for them because I wasn't financially able to, and I was feeling depressed and sad and stuff like that. I want you to not feel that way. It's not that important. Christmas is one one day. If you can't afford to gift all this stuff, don't beat yourself up about it. Give your children love, smile, put on clothes, take them outside, they can ride their own stuff, teach them to value their old stuff. Like my kids gonna ride their regular bike still, even after Christmas, they're going to have new bikes, but they might want to ride their old bikes still. For any of you who like peaches, why you won't donate everything you got? I can't do it. I really can't. I love holding on to stuff. Some of that stuff is older than my kids. Some of the stuff I got in my closet, I got clothes. Like this, this shirt I got on, I bought this shirt when I was pregnant with choice. That's how bad I am with giving away stuff. It just means a lot to me. I cherish what I have. And I just want to be able to pass it down to my kids. Now, if you're wondering, like, Peaches, what have you done for others? Well, in the past, I have done Christmas giveaways. One year when I was doing really well, I actually paid for Christmas hairdos for a bunch of kids. Like, we spent over $10,000 doing that. Next year, I do plan on giving back. I know I'll be in a better position financially. But this year, I'm not rich, okay? I know y'all see your girl coming up on YouTube. But I'm not rich. I have five children. I'm going to take care of my home first. And I hope you all do the same and have a Merry, Merry Christmas. If you like this video, you know what to do. You know what to do. Go ahead and hit a likey like. Hey, hit a likey like. Hit a likey like for your girl. Wish me luck with finding a trio. We gonna have one out the dollar store. Like, 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 let's go. Like, 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 like to the phone. One like, two like, three like, four. Like you like soon as you see my videos You know your girl funny, yeah, you know your girl That's dope right. If you really like me, why wouldn't you hit it, yo? L to the IK, E-Y, babe Hit a like you like and send that love my way L to the IK, E-Y, babe Hit a like you like and send that love my way Like, 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 let's go